Hey guys, it's Christy Hoost. I've been using this video conferencing platform for a few months now and I really love it. It's got some amazing features, it's easy to use. So I wanted to tell you about it so you can use it for your own business online. So it's called Zoom. And uh, what I like to use it for is shooting quick videos. I can record them right through Zoom. Um, one of my favorite features in Zoom is your ability to share your screen. So you can be on this Zoom video and you can actually show people exactly what you're doing on your computer, on online or through different applications. So what you can actually do is invite people to your Zoom conference and it's a live video conference. So they can see you, you can see them, you can talk back and forth, you can have a chat role going where you can type away and be writing messages that way. And you can share your screen with people and they can share their screen with you. So where this is really helpful is building teams or with new people who are just trying to set things up on the computer, you can have them here live, you can talk to them, and you can show them exactly what to do on the computer to get things set up and rolling. So since I'm using Zoom, I'm going to share my screen with you and show you some of the cool features here. So what this is, I actually had to take screenshots because I want to show you what Zoom looks like, but since I'm using the program, I wasn't able to show you me using the program, if that makes sense. So I just took some screenshots here. So after you set up your Zoom account and you download the program, when you log in, it's going to take you to this menu. And there's some different features you can play around with here, but um, for today, I just want to show you basic Zoom video conferencing. So you can use video or not use video. Um, I recommend always using video. Even if you didn't brush your hair for the day, it's okay. It's great to make that personal connection with people to see them face to face. So you would click on this start with video and then it will take you to, hmm, I hope this is showing right. Let me try something again here. Okay, hopefully you're seeing the right screen. It'll take you to a screen that looks like this. This is where you're gonna see yourself, you're gonna see the other participants in your meeting. Um, you can see along the bottom here, you can, everyone in the meeting can mute or unmute, they can stop and start their own video. Uh, you as the host are able to manage the participants. You see this number one because I'm the only one on my conference today because I'm just shooting a video. But this gives you a little control. You can mute everyone out if it's getting noisy or something like that. Uh, this is where you can use your chat, open up that chat box, and you can record this and it will create a file for you. Um, this is the, the share screen button that I told you about. Now, one thing I want to show you is how to invite people. So you would click this button, and let me show you the screen that it takes you to. Just a second here. Okay, it would take you to, um, yeah, it'll, sh it'll ask you if you want to invite through email or IM. I like to use email. So it'll take you to this email. It's already typed out for you. All you have to do is enter the email addresses of the people you want to invite. Now, if you have a larger team or don't have all their email addresses, maybe you'll have um, a Facebook chat group or a Skype chat group going. And in that case, you can take the link on this email and pop it right into that chat group so people can click on that link and join you in your conference right at that time. And here's that link. It says join from PC, Mac, etc. And then there'll be a Zoom link. So you just grab that link, post it in your chat, and then people will be able to click on it and, and join your group that way. So let me see if there's anything else I wanted to tell you about. Um, so once you stop recording and you end your meeting, Zoom is going to create a file for you. It'll be saved to your computer. You can save it wherever you want. Um, and then at that point, you can also share it 
right from there. They make it super easy. Um, so you can upload it right to YouTube or you can share on social media. You can take that link or um, take that file and pass it off to the people who were on the conference if they need the recording of it. So those are some of the cool features of Zoom. I think it's a great tool uh, for video conferencing. It helps you to shoot videos, build your online business, do team building activities. And I just wanted to share that with you today. So if this has been helpful, go ahead and share in the comments below, share on your social media. And for more tips and tools on building your online business, please visit ChristyHoost.com. Or no, I'm sorry, ChristyHoostBlog.com. I'll put the link below. Thanks, guys.